Hey everyone, welcome to Monday. As you can see, I am doing my workouts again. I did a little warm up. I love Pamela Reith warm ups. Um, and then I, I'm back with Grow With Jo. <laughs> I feel like me and her are besties now. But yeah, just still trying to... Oh, Apple's the TV. Just still trying to get back into the, a routine and be happier with myself, really. That's everything. And we'll continue with the vlog. And I'm just interrupting because I wanted to let you know that this documentary was really interesting. It was really sad, but interesting. And um, especially because a lot of the shows that I watched were on there. I watched a lot of Nickelodeon. So this is a really good documentary um, into the insights of what we didn't realise what was happening back in the day so yeah I'd highly recommend it if you can watch it. Hello welcome to Tuesday. <laughs> I have just been working and for the rest of the week I am working so I'm gonna try and make this week different, exciting, something to watch. <laughs> Funko Pop collection with you. If you're not into this I have put chapters in so you can scroll past this section but if you are hello or if you're just nosy i have nine at the minute i say at the minute because it keeps growing <laughs> i have got this mickey i think he was called like the clubhouse leader mickey or something like that um but he's very cute stefan got me him he's got a little hat on he's a bit dirty <laughs> But no, very cute. <laughs> can stand there and make all the little people have a good day. Now, the next two are actually the same person, but I got one that doesn't stand up. It's really annoying. I need to get her a little stand. And um, the other one does stand up, but you'll see why I got the both. So... Here is one. This is baby Anna. She still has like her little stripe from Elsa. She's in her little Norwegian dress. I honestly love this dress on her. And she has got ducks around her. Like how cute is she? And then I actually got this one first because I really do like Anna. Baby Anna's going <laughs> to stare at you like that. Um, so this is Anna from Frozen 2. So this is from the first Frozen, Frozen 1. <laughs> um, and this is Frozen 2's Anna. She's got her cape on. She's ready to climb the mountain and she's just ready. So it's older Anna and baby Anna. But I feel like next to each other, you'd probably know that they're the same person. But I put them on different shelves, so... Ooh. She can't stand up. I need to get her a stand. The Disney princesses. I have three more princesses. I can give you clues. One's wearing yellow, one's wearing blue, one's wearing purple. <laughs> They're probably very obvious. So this is Belle. She is the prettiest of them all. <laughs> um, I love the detail on her dress if it doesn't focus on me. <laughs> um... Yeah, she's just very pretty. And look at her hair at the back. Very nice. Love Belle. Going into a theme. This is Elsa. I feel like this was a 30th anniversary Elsa. Um, I can't remember the box, but I have a feeling it was because she has all her um, ice around her and her cape. But yes, also from Frozen. <laughs> Ooh, and she nearly died, so... Yeah, very nice. Had to go in theme. I love the little snowflakes in her hair. I love the cape. She's cute. Now, this is my, one of my favourite ones. <laughs> a 
look how cute she's got a little feet out she's painting pascals on her head this is rapunzel if anybody doesn't know um she's painting all the murals of the lanterns on her bedroom walls well tower walls shall we say and yeah she's just really nice i love rapunzel's and tangled is one of my favorites so yeah rapunzel we have ron <laughs> Ron Weasley from Harry Potter with his little broken wand. That's so cute. He Ron is one of the newest additions to the family. Um, I just really like Ron. And I would have got him before any of the other ones. Maybe Luna, because I named my dog after Luna. And I have Luna's wand, if you can read that. Ta-da! I have her wand, so... Yeah, Ron. <laughs> we have Hedwig. <laughs> Stefan got me this one. He got me both, actually. Um, he was... He's the main provider of Funko Pops, apparently. <laughs> so that's why my collection is growing. Um, but yeah, Hedwig. Little owl. I'm not an owl. That's all I think about. <laughs> Lastly, we have Marion from she's a bobblehead as well from indiana jones it's indiana jones's wife that's a mouthful she has a monkey on her arm she's got nice sandals on <laughs> very red and very bobbly <laughs> oh she's the only bobblehead i have at the minute and i got stefan indiana so how cute <laughs> So we have Miriam and baby Anna. We have, I need to call him Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh is not in this frame. Um, Mickey and then all the princesses up there. And then Ron and Hedwig in that one. So yeah, that's everyone, including a little mini and a Simba money box. <laughs> the sky looks really cool this morning. And Luna's outside. <laughs> this is not going for a wee, but okay. I was doing this clip so confidently and then the cleaner walks in front of me and I thought, oh, that's so awkward. <laughs> and I finished work and I was going to Stefan's house. You'll see the only clip I filmed coming up. <laughs> Come for the eggs and stay for the tender leg of lamb. Better than half Very the interesting. Pasta. That's more like it. So interested. It's a really good video. Are you not happy with that video? <laughs> Hello. Um, I thought I would let you know about some of the holidays i'm going on this year i'm not going to say dates obviously i'll say months and stuff and i will show you some show <laughs> that's hard to say i will show you some clips and videos and you'll understand a bit more but the first holiday i'm going to talk about is in may it's actually mine and stefan's first holiday together like a long holiday we've been on like city breaks and stuff like that before but this is like abroad together um and it's gonna be really nice it's in may and we're going to crete it's gonna be lovely and i'll show you pictures of the hotel um i don't know how we've managed to pay for it <laughs> can't lie we booked it a long time ago so we like paid over it for a couple of months um and now yeah it's done very excited i'll show you a few outfits here and there as well in my last vlog i showed you two outfits that are going to be possible evening like you'll see how they're not too fancy but they can be dressed up as well i don't usually go for the ceiling a long dress but I thought I'd branch out and I'm five foot seven so I'm a tall girly and the dress length was perfect because that's what I kind of find awkward with dresses because I'm so tall half the dresses I'm like oh that looks so nice but I know it's going to be a bit too short and 
yeah I always wear shorts under dresses anyway most of the time but sometimes it just doesn't look right if the shorts are too far i'm really gonna try and be a long skirt person because i do love them i just need to figure out how to wear them so if you have any tips let me know because i am all for it we're going for seven nights it's now eight nights technically because the flights um flight times got changed so that's fine we're flying from birmingham um, I've never been to Birmingham Airport. I've only ever been on a plane once. And that was last year for the girls' holiday. And I filmed that as well. Did a little montage bit. I'm going to do what I did for that holiday and do the same thing. Because I don't want to film the entire thing because it's our time. I know Stefan wouldn't mind, but I don't want to... I want to live in the moment but also want to share it so I can look back on it look back on it we have booked an aquarium uh, we're staying by Crete's first aquarium I think it is um so that's going to be an experience apparently there's like a lot of roaming animals I know you said roaming characters I live in a Disney world too much <laughs> which brings me on to the next holiday that I'll talk about in a minute but yeah, and then we're going to book the water park as well because we both really want to go to the water park. And the UK is not really a place where you can go to a nice water park and be warm. <laughs> the rest of the days, we're just going to chill out. Definitely needed for the both, both of us. And just explore the hotel and explore around. So yeah, that's the first holiday. It's very nice. Very excited counting down because <laughs> it's not too long so the second um holiday i'm going to talk about as i've already little briefly mentioned going to disney again disneyland paris obviously is amazing they've got the whole adventures campus and that's just that was open because the last time we went there they were doing like press days of that um so we just missed the opening but that's fine because it gave us another opportunity to come back so we're going in october how exciting one of the seasons i haven't done disney in and i'm excited it's one of my favorite seasons like colors and everything and the characters gonna look so cute in the little outfits i'm going on that one with Katie, George and Erin. So Katie and George I went on the last Disney trip with and then Erin is coming this year. So that'll be nice for of us having a great time and they're gonna all laugh at me again because I don't need a map because I am the map. <laughs> I bought some new ears for that as well, obviously, because I need more, clearly. It's definitely a happy place of mine and it's just magical you just feel so engrossed in all the characters but i'm a bit sad that the 30th anniversary um is over because the songs the parades honestly were a vibe so i'm a bit sad about that <laughs> i'll be singing ready for the ride even though they're not gonna do it anymore but we'll get all the halloween shows and that'll be fun to see hopefully there might be a few little breaks in the middle of those two i haven't got anything else planned at the minute but i thought i'd just let you know this will be the end of the weekly so give it a big thumbs up if you did please subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you very soon bye <laughs>